Hi students, what are fractions? A number when written in p by q form with two conditions. The first condition, one the denominator should not be equal to 0 and both the numerator and denominator that is p by q. It should be non-negative integers. So this is called as fractions. Then we saw types of fractions like fraction, unlike fraction, mixed fraction, proper fraction, improper fraction. So today what we are going to see is we are going to apply basic arithmetic operations in our fractions. What are like fractions? Fractions with the same denominators are called as like fractions. So let us apply addition operation and subtraction operation to the like fractions. 4 by 7 plus 3 by 7. See both the denominators are same. So it is like fractions. Let us add both of these like fractions. Since it is like fractions in the answer also the denominator would be the same. That is 7. 4 plus 3, 7 itself, okay. So only for the numerator we should apply addition. For the denominator directly you can write the denominator by itself. So both 7 will be cancelled and answer is 1. Next moving on to subtraction. So in subtraction, let us take like fractions. 3 by 10 minus 1 by 10. So same thing we have to do here. We can just subtract directly if it is like fractions. 3 by 10 minus 1 by 10. In answer also, same denominator will come for like fractions. So 10, 10 over here and in the answer also we can write 10 as the denominator. Moving on to the numerator. So 3 minus 1, it is 2. So 2 by 10. Always in fraction, give the final answer as a simple term. So how to make this as a simple term? We can cancel it still. So 2 ones are 2, 2 fives are 10. So 1 by 5. Now, we have completed addition separately and subtraction separately for like fractions. Let us combine both addition and subtraction. 7 by 9 plus 5 by 9 minus 2 by 9. So, we have both arithmetic operations such as addition as well as subtraction. So, here what we are going to do is, since we, it is a like fraction, so the common term, that is the common denominator is 9. So, let us write 9 as the common denominator as the answer. Moving on to the numerator. So 7 plus 5 minus 2. So for 7 also if the symbol is not given we should consider it as addition symbol. Okay. So plus 7 plus 5 minus 2. What is 7 plus 5? 12. So first I will complete the addition operation which is together. Then minus 2 is separately done. Divided by 9. 12 minus 2 is 10. So the final answer is 10 by 9. So here we have seen addition in like fractions, subtraction in like fraction, addition and subtraction both combined together given in like fraction. Next let us move on to unlike fractions. So solving unlike fractions. Addition and subtraction in unlike fractions. So let us take two fractions over here. 3 by 5 plus 2 by 7. So they are different denominators over here. 5 and 7 are different. This is unlike fraction. So whenever you see different denominators, that is unlike fractions, immediately you have to take both the denominators and do LCM. 5 and 7. So now take LCM for 5 and 7. 5 ones are 5. So 7 will not go in 5. So I will write the 7 here directly below. Both 7 and 5 are prime factors. So 7 ones are 7. So let us find the LCM for this 5 into 7. So 5 7 are 35, right? So write the LCM as a common denominator, 35. Now compare our questions denominator with our LCM, okay? Our LCM is 35 and the first fraction's denominator is 5. So 5 into what is 35? 5 into 7 is 35. We have given into 5 to the denominator of the first fraction. The same into 7 we have to give to the numerator also. So into 7 to the denominator and into 7 to the numerator. So if you give into 7 to the numerator 3 7 are 21. Then in the middle addition operation is there. So let us write this. Same process we have to follow to the second fraction. So 7 into what is 35? 7 into what is 35? 7 into 5. So now we give into 5 to the denominator. The same into 5 we have to give to the numerator. Into 5. So already 2 is there. What is 2 into 5 in the numerator? 10. So let us write 10 over here. 
Hope you understood. So, 21 plus 10 is 31. 31 by 35. Now, let us see subtraction in unlike fraction. 5 by 3 minus 2 by 6. So, in this, both are unlike fraction, different denominators. So, take 3 and 6 and find LCM. So, 3 comma 6. Let us find LCM for this. So, we have a common factor in this, right? So, 3 ones are 3. 3 into what is 6? 3 twos are 6. Now, 2 times. 2 ones are 2. So, ultimate aim is to make all the factors here as 1. So, after 1 comes, let us find the LCM. 3 into 2. All the prime factors over here. So, 3 twos are 6. 6 is the LCM for our question. 6. Write 6, the LCM as the common denominator. Now, compare our denominator with our question. So, the first fraction, the denominator is 3 over here. 3 into what? You will get 6. 3 twos are 6, right? So, into 2 we gave to the denominator. Same into 2 give to the numerator also. Into 2. So, what is 5 twos are 10. Minus symbol is there here. So, put minus symbol, subtraction. Then, compare the LCM with our next fraction. So, 6 into what is 6? 6 into 1 is 6. We have given into 1 to the denominator. Same into 1 give to the numerator also. Into 1. So, 2 into 1 is 2. Hope you understood students. Now, just perform the basic operation of subtraction. 10 minus 2 is equal to 8. 8 divided by 6. As I already told you, convert our fraction into simple term. Our final answer into simple term. Both are the multiples of 2. 2 3s are 6, 2 4s are 8. The final answer is 4 by 3. Combining both addition as well as subtraction, we have 3 terms here. First term, second term, 3 terms of fractions. So here, plus 2 by 3, plus 5 by 4, minus 3 by 6. As we look here, we can observe that these are unlike fractions. So let us take LCM for this. So what is the first denominator? 3, second denominator 4, third denominator 6. We have common factors also here. Common multiples. We have common multiples here. So, first let us solve 3. 1s are 3. 4. Is it a multiple of 3? No. So, we cannot do anything with 4. So, write 4 directly. Under 3 time table, 4 will not come at all. So, I will write the 4 directly over here. But 6 will come. No. 3 into what is 6? 3 into 2 is 6. Next. So, 4 and 2. Both will go in 2 time table. So, 2. Write 2. That one directly down. Then 2 into what is 4? 2 2s are 4. 2 into what is 2? 2 1s are 2. Again, we have 2 left over here. So, again take the prime factor as 2. So, already 1 is there. Here also 1 is there. 2 1s are 2. So, we have got everything as 1. So, let us stop and find the LCM. Check out what are all the prime factors here. 3 into 2 into 2. So, 3 2s are 6. 6 2s are 12. 12 is our LCM. Now we have to check. Now we have to compare our question. Each fractions to our LCM. So 3 into what is 12? 3 4s are 12. So whatever I give to the denominator, I should give to the numerator. Into 4 I give to the denominator. Same into 4 I have to give to the numerator also. Here. 4 into what is 12? 4 3s are 12. So into 3 I gave to the denominator. Same into 3 I have to give to the numerator. Here, 6 into what is 12? 6 2s are 12. Into 2 I gave to the denominator. Same multiplied by 2. Into 2 I have to give to the numerator. Now let us multiply the numerators and write the answer. So 2 4s are 8. 5 3s are 15. 3 2s are 6. Now look what operation is there. Addition symbol. Here is a fraction symbol. Got it ma? Very simple. So 8 plus 8. If no symbols are given, you should consider as plus 8. So plus 8 plus 15. Let us solve the like symbols first. Both are like, right? Both are in addition. So let us solve this first. 8 plus 15 is 23. So plus 23 minus 6. We have 12 as a denominator. So, plus 23 minus 6. Already I have told you in integers. Different signs do subtraction. Put greater number sign. So, these are different signs. Plus 23 minus 6. Different signs. What do you have to do? Subtraction. So, subtract both. 23 minus 6 is 17. And put the greater number sign. Which number is greater? 23 or 6? 23 only knows greater. So, what symbol 23 is having? Plus addition symbol. 
So put plus 17 divided by same denominator the LCM which we got. So 17 by 12 is the answer. So we have seen addition and subtraction under like fraction and unlike fraction. Now we are going to apply that into mixed fraction. We have mixed fraction over here. So this is the integral part, this is the fractional part. So what we have to do is whenever we see a mixed fraction, first convert, convert that mixed fraction. After that you can apply the LCM or addition or subtraction operation. So how to convert it? First put multiplication symbol below. So 3 twos are 3 into 2, 3 twos are 6 plus that answer. So 6 is the answer right, 6 plus 2, 8. So 8 by 3, the same denominator. So moving on to the second term. 2 3s are 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. 7 by 2. Now you can observe both the denominators are different. So we have to find the LCM. The LCM for 3 and 2. 3 1s are 3. So 2 I will write directly. Next. 2 1s are 2. So what is the LCM? Prime factors are 3 and 2. 3 2s are 6. So 6 is our LCM. So let us take 6 over here. Now compare our LCM with the question. The first fraction denominator is 3. 3 into what is 6? 3 into 2 is 6. So I gave into 2 to the denominator. Same into 2 I will give to the numerator. 8 2 is 16. Addition symbol is here. So write addition symbol. 2 into what is 6? 2 into 3 is 6. So same into 3 I will give to the numerator. 7 into 3 is 21. 16 plus 21 is 37. 37 by same denominator 6. So you have to observe. We have found the answer. But it is not in mixed fraction. If they give the question in the mixed fraction. We have to give them the answer in mixed fraction only. So we have to convert this into mixed fraction. So how to convert 37 divided by 6. So divide 37 and 6. 6, 6 are 36. The remainder would be 1. So the quotient is 6. Remainder is 1. And the divisor is 6. So let us write in the mixed fraction over here. Quotient, reminder by divisor. So what will be the answer? Quotient is 6. Reminder is 1. Divisor is 6. This is the answer. The so same like this. Shall we do subtraction operation over here? So first let us convert. 2 into 8. 8 2's are 16. 16 plus 1. 17 divided by 2. Then put minus symbol. 8 3's are 24. 24 plus 5. 29. 29 divided by 8. Same denominator. So 17 by 2 minus 29 by 8. Kindly observe. They are different denominators right. So take LCM. It is unlike fraction. So whenever you look at unlike fractions. Directly you can start with LCM. 2 comma 8. So 2 1's are 2. 2 into what is 8? 2 4's are 8. Again. Take with the least number. You can put 4 here. But always start from the prime numbers. Least prime numbers. So again 2. 2 2's are 4. Again 2 times. 2 1's are 2. So what is the LCM? 2 into 2 into 2. 2 2's are 4. 4 2's are 8. LCM is 8. So let us rate the LCM as 8. Now let us compare our LCM with the question. 2 into what is 8? 2 into 4 is 8. So whatever I gave to the denominator, I will give to the numerator also into 4. So what is 17 into 4? It is 68. 68 then this minus operation I will write over here. Then compare 8 with our LCM. 8 into 1 is 8. 29 into 1 whatever I give to the into 1 I gave to the de denominator. Same into 1 I gave to the numerator too. So 29 into 1. 29 itself. Hope you understood students. So 68 minus 29 is 39. 39 divided by the same denominator that is a LCM. So 39 divided by 8. Can we solve this? Can we make it into a simple term? We cannot cancel this. Both are of different multiples. But we have to change it into mixed fraction. So divide it. 39 divided by 8. 8 fours are 32. Reminder would be 7. Quotient, reminder and divisor. Quotient, reminder by divisor. The answer would be 4 as the quotient, 7 as the reminder and 8 as the divisor. So 4, 7 by 8 is the final answer.